Hey guys, what we got here is a 1950s, or perhaps even a 1960s, Electrohome 8-inch desk fan. This is a non-oscillating single-speed fan, and I'm guessing this was probably Electrohome's base model back in the day. Um, it's got the bare-bone minimum <laughs> that you could expect from a fan. Just one speed, uh, non-oscillating, just got basic tilt, just all around a really simple budget-friendly fan. Now, this is a green fan, green fan for St. Patrick's Day, well, even though, well, today is St. Patrick's Day, but tomorrow when I'll be posting this video, it won't be, but anyways, uh, this fan was my first find of 2023. I got this sometime back in January, and uh, it's in pretty good shape, actually in remarkable condition. Let's uh, have a closer look at this thing. I haven't even cleaned this fan yet, but check out how clean it is already. Just a little bit of dust in the nooks and crannies, and I'm sure the motor housing has some dust in it, but on the exterior, it's quite nice. I mean, the paint still has a good shine to it. The chrome is still shining. It's got a neat looking badge there. Kind of minimalistic, but still pretty nice. Now, I do believe this is the latest out of the, um, the Electro Home fans that I've got. Uh, right there, that one there is the oldest one that I've got, it's the Electro Home Long Life, and the one on the, the salmon colored one there, with the stars, I believe that's kind of in between this one and the Long Life, potentially. So yeah, it's in really nice condition, just got a stamped aluminum blade, there's the bullet shaped rear motor housing. Now I do believe the stand is somewhat bent because yeah, it's not really standing quite straight. Yeah, that one's leaning down quite a bit, so I'll have to look into it. So it's got a single speed rotary switch, stamped metal base, and it is wall mountable. Original cord with a non-polarized plug on there. All right, so let's give it a test. I did test this before, but um, I do believe it needs some work. But we'll see. Like I said, just one speed, so it's all or nothing. So here it is on high. <laughs> Likes to dance, that's for sure. Yeah, the blades are definitely. Oh yeah, I can see the blades kind of waving back and forth, so that needs to be tweaked, but it looks like this is just a common case of gummed up oil in the bearings, so the motor needs to be taken apart and re-oiled. I can do that, no problem. It's actually starting to pick up speed. Well, there it goes. Oh yeah. That's about full speed, I would say. And, and she's pretty good air. That's, that's that's pretty powerful. Wow, I'm actually pretty impressed. Yeah, I don't want to run it too long with the bearings like that. Actually, the spin down time is not that bad. Huh. I also want to show you guys the blade pitch situation. See if I can get it on camera here. Alright. Spin it up for a little bit. Yeah, you can see the blades kind of fluttering back and forth. So that needs, needs to be tweaked, but I'm pretty sure once I fix that it'll be all good. Alright. Well, there it is, guys. That is the 1950s Electrohome Long Life 8-inch non-oscillating desk fan. So eventually there'll be a video on this fan getting cleaned up, or at least a full video if I don't get to that, so stay tuned for that. Uh, first day of spring is actually just around the corner, so that's exciting. So anyways, that's a wrap, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Peace.